Working Principle of Arc Welding Arc welding is a process that joins metals by melting and fusing them together using an electric arc. The electric arc is formed between the workpiece, the metal being welded, and an electrode, which is usually a consumable metal wire. The intense heat generated by the arc melts the metal, and when it solidifies, it forms a strong bond between the workpiece and the electrode. Here's a step-by-step -step explanation of the working principle of arc welding. Power Source An electric power source, typically a transformer or an electric generator, supplies the necessary voltage and current for the welding process. The power source converts the input electrical energy into a suitable welding current. Electrode Selection Depending on the specific application, a suitable electrode is chosen. The electrode can be either a consumable or non-consumable type. Consumable electrodes are made of a metal alloy that melts during welding, while non-consumable electrodes are typically made of tungsten and do not melt. Electrode Holder The electrode is held in an electrode holder or electrode clamp, which provides electrical contact and allows the welder to manipulate the electrode during the welding process. Ground Clamp a ground clamp is attached to the workpiece, providing a connection to the other terminal of the power source. This completes the electrical circuit required for the welding process. Arc Initiation The welder brings the electrode close to the workpiece and establishes an arc gap. When the electrode and the workpiece come into close proximity, the voltage difference between them ionizes the surrounding air and creates an electric arc. Arc Formation the electric arc produces a high-intensity heat source that reaches temperatures of several thousand degrees Celsius. This intense heat causes the metal at the welding point to melt and form a molten pool. Welding Process The welder manipulates the electrode and guides it along the joint, controlling the size and direction of the molten pool. As the electrode melts, in the case of consumable electrodes, metal droplets transfer across the arc and fuse with the molten pool, creating a solid joint. Shielding Gas to protect the weld from atmospheric contamination, a shielding gas may be used. The gas, such as argon or carbon dioxide, is usually supplied through the welding torch or nozzle and forms a protective atmosphere around the arc and weld pool, preventing oxidation and improving the quality of the weld. Solidification As the molten pool cools, the metal solidifies and forms a strong bond between the welded materials. This solidified metal is called the weld bead. Arc welding is a versatile and widely used welding process due to its ability to join a variety of metals and its effectiveness in creating strong and durable welds. The specific parameters, such as the welding current, voltage, electrode type, and shielding gas, can be adjusted based on the metal being welded, the joint design, and the desired welding characteristics.